our next topic is quantization we have already seen that the first step of any dsp system is adc analog to digital converter which is a two stage process in fact three stage process the first step is the sampling process followed by quantization and then coding most of the signals that we encounter in science and engineering are analog signals so we need to do sampling first to convert the signal the input signal to the sampling process is in the form of analog and it is also called continuous time signals time is continuous amplitude is also continuous continuous in time and continuous in amplitude for example x of t is equal to sin 2 pi ft is a continuous signal here t can take any continuous value 0.1 or 0.11 or 0.1154 in fact any value and produce x which is also continuous next the signal that is coming out of the sampling process is in discrete form and it is called discrete time signal time is discrete amplitude is continuous discrete in time and continuous in amplitude for example x of n is equal to sin 2 pi f n t s is a discrete signal t s is the sampling period if we take the sampling period as 0.1 then at the multiples of 0.1 we are going to take the samples at 0.1 0.2 0.3 and so forth so time is discretized but amplitudes will take continuous values since we have to work on digital signal processors or to do digital signal processing in any digital hardware we need finite precision numbers that means the number of bits required to represent the amplitude values need to be limited maybe 16 bits or 24 bits practically for this we have to bring down the continuous range of amplitude values into a limited set of values this is what we are doing in quantization we are mapping the continuous range of values into a limited set of values so amplitudes are also discretized here time is discrete amplitude is also discrete discrete in time and discrete in amplitude which is called digital signals the final stage is a coder which converts the discretized amplitude value into a binary number for example for a 2 bit number 2 power n that is four amplitude levels are there in quantization similarly for a 8 bit number 2 power 8 that is 256 amplitude levels are there in quantization so sampling converts the analog signal into discrete signal and quantization converts the discrete signal into a digital signal next we will understand the quantization little bit more using an example in the next episode thanks for watching don't forget to rate comment and subscribe bye bye